at this point, all you can do is laugh. Kimball Walker, no Kimball Walker. Terry Rozier, Devontae Graham, uh, P.J. Washington, Miles, uh, whatever his name is, from Miles Bridges from Michigan State. The Pistons cannot beat the Charlotte Hornets. All right, they fall again tonight, 107-110. And let's talk about the game. I do appreciate everybody for checking in. Make sure that subscribe button, bell icon button. Share the video. I will drop the Justin Coleman video before midnight. Okay. Um... I mean, I mean, let's just go through the box score real quick. Um, uh, PJ Washington had the game of his life. He rookie out of Memphis, and um, he bought out tonight, man. He did, man. He really did. He had twenty six points, man, and um, five rebounds, three assists. I mean, Devonte Graham, he did his thing, and Derrick Rose had twenty three points, and you know, man. Just, <laughs> I, I just can't explain this game, man. And you know, Andre Drummond let Bismack Biombo, he let him have a game of his life as well. And you know, early on, they was going back and forth. It was about even at halftime. And third quarter, the Pistons won the third quarter. And then coming down the stretch. It was just lack of execution, man. Once again, Andre Drummond let uh he let Terry Rozier get the ball off a loose ball. I don't know if it, I guess it would count as a steal. And he tried to go like one on three, and then he bumped into somebody, and Rozier got the ball, and that kind of turned turned the tide coming down the stretch again. It was like a carbon copy of what happened last time. You know, Dre turned it over late. And he posed a dominated guy like Biz McBiombo. This is a dude that been inconsistent, but he he did a lot of things in the in the in the stat sheets that don't that's not gonna show up. A lot of tips he gave Dre some fits. He was third. He had thirteen points, ten rebounds, but he played a lot better than the stats say. Drummond had fifteen, nineteen, and three assists. But like I said before, you just you can't explain it, man. Rose had that bounce in his step. Uh, you know, Galloway, he had a four point play to give him some separation. Kennard shot the ball well as today. Um, but you know, it just must be a curse on the Lions versus, the, I mean, <laughs> the Lions and curse and Lions go well. Pistons uh, going against the Hornets. They was at home this time. They beat us, I think four times this last year. They beat us three times already this year. So they at least got a seven game winning streak in. Now looking at the game, it's just they 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 hustle harder, they battle hard, and Andre Drummond sitting on the bench like he, he crying, and I can't explain it. I can't explain it. The Pistons had a lead in the fourth quarter. It was like ninety eight to one hundred three or whatever it was. It was a nice little five six seven point lead, and you know when Dre fumbled well fumbled the ball when he coughed the ball up. And he got it off the second chance opportunity. He went one on two or one on three, and Rozier got the ball back. I believe he came up the court, and somehow I think they hit a three pointer. Washington hit an amazing three pointer at the top of the key, and they just got the rolling, you know. And one thing that works in you know a team like Charlotte, I'm gonna tell you why they give the Pistons fits this year at least, and probably last year too. They guards can penetrate, and the Pistons suck against defending guards that can penetrate. They 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 got young legs. They got quick penetrating uh penetrating guards. Their guards can shoot, you know, from the forest bridges. The guards Graham, Terry Rozier, Malik Monk can get it off the bounce, or he can take it to the hole. Um, they just they just too agile on on the uh they too agile on the perimeter, and the Pistons don't have the legs to keep up with a young team like this, man. Off the dribble, they can't keep up with them. Pistons too old on the on the perimeter. Even when Reggie come back, Galloway, he don't have the quickest feet. Derrick Rose, he old. Blake Griffin, he old. Only one that really got live feet out there is going to be Andre Drummond since they don't really play uh, Christian Woods like that. And Luke Kennard, he can't really stick with nobody for real. So the the the, the Hornets going to be a, mad, a bad matchup because the Pistons can't defend those quick guards on, on, the, uh, on the perimeter. And Bismack Biombo and Marvin Williams and P.J. Washington gave them enough juice on, on the front line to, to hold off Andre Drummond. And Drummond picked up about three ticky-tack fouls. But other than that, man, Blake Griffin, he another guy. You know, he he just too slow right now. You know what I'm saying? And will he get that bounce or that agility or that 
that first step back, oh, we gotta wait and see. But it's a bad style, you know, bad style for the for the, for the Pistons to go up against, and they just too quick on the perimeter. And you know, Drummond, it's only so much he can do to to erase on the back end. But that last sequence, if you didn't see the game, uh, Pistons was down by three. I think they got to stop on they got they got to stop on the other end. Uh, Kennard get the rebound and call a timeout. And um, long story short, I think they tried to get it to Blake or whatever, but. You know, Luke Kennard, he pulls up, you know, for a premature contested three, um, comes up short, kicks tips back out past half court. Galloway didn't know what the time was, but he heaved it up in time and almost went in the sense of overtime, but it didn't. But late game execution, that falls on the coach. And once again, the same scenario, the Wayne Casey uh, late game play fails to be executed. So, you know, to a certain extent, it falls out on him. But um, it is what it is. You know, Biombo did enough. And versus Drummond, he got to start letting, you know, weak third string, second string centers get off on him. But it is what it is. Let me know what you guys thought about the game. Pistons fall 107-110 to the Hornets of Charlotte. Don't forget me on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. Reach out to the email if you got business questions, inquiry, response to your video requests. Appreciate the love support. Best way to donate is share the video. Let me know what you guys thought about the game. We gone.